Wow, this holds 46 barrels. Yes, I think it does. That's a good name. <laughs> All righty. So I redid the track, Grizzly. That's awesome. Um, we've got another engine over here to move some of the cars around. I raised the track up quite a bit because the way this thing kind of sits in a hole. And so what I found with the barrel train here is... With the track up high, it doesn't like to roll... You lose like three or four barrels or a couple barrels right off the bat. Yeah. They bounce back and then they don't make it on top of the car. So I raised the track up on top of this because guess what? When oil falls, it comes out of the ground or out of the sky. I mean, not out of the ground. So uh, if you yeah. look up high, yeah, you know, they just kind of magically fall out of the air. I mean, I see that. Andre the Giant must be back here throwing it up in the air. All right. <laughs> so, you know. That's pretty weird. So that's why I moved it, because the bottom of the platform is, like, way up there underneath the, about the middle of the wheels. Yeah. And it was just like, you know, we was losing two or three, and I didn't really want to lose that many. All right. No, nope, don't blame you. So that's these barrels though. that I already had loaded, I was kind of, that was all kind of test run seeing how this worked yep that's fine I suppose i could load this while you're loading that one right mm -hmm. i mean you could that no biggie because we're gonna have to bring another load of oil up here ah, dang that freaking thing Huh, that's shooting over. Yeah. Hold on. Why is it doing that? You see that? That one's shot over. I'll let you take a look at that after this loads. I'm going to put this thing back up and stop it real quick. It's shooting off. The backside? Yeah, over here. It's landing over here in the ground. Well, I may, it may need uh, moved over a little bit then, maybe. I don't know. I didn't see it. Do you want to go? Uh... Yeah. Because when I did it earlier, I only tested like four barrel. And they all four went right on the, the wagon. Uh -huh. and so it's doing like a two and two or three maybe four and four I'll try not to put it all the way down maybe that it was actually working but I don't know if it is or isn't it, we lost two barrels. but the rest of them's all been going straight on all right, so it can't have the thing all the way down. Yeah, you must be. It must be uh, shooting it too far, I guess. What's up, Green? Yeah, what overshooting it, Grizzly? Jeez, yeah, you, you well, should know this having, stuff. Yeah, with having like that, it should be all right should load this I think so we'll try it
and the to the two platforms are a different height anyways it's like they weren't completely correct right I guess I'll make sure the train's got some, uh, maybe some fuel oh. to keep it engine nice and warm. Okay, that one's full now. That one's full, so. How many is left here? Seventeen and twenty. I don't know if you want to finish loading this thing or Yeah, right there. Now this one I can put all the way down, right? Uh, I just usually just do it to the point where it starts loading. Probably gonna have to go a little bit more. Or kind of, there you go. So do we want to go get the oil train and fill it up and bring it back up here? And that way we can make some more uh, oil barrels and we'll just whatever we bring up with the next one and fill this thing back up we can do that i'm sure it's not going to be a full load but and guys you can see the track backer behind me it just kind of goes away and stops right over there and it connects in with the other side over there i haven't tested it yet but we're getting ready to here in a minute we're going to load this thing up, go get a load of oil, bring back up here, and then whatever we make with the uh, pipes that we have and stuff, we'll, we'll load this up one more time or whatever we got and take it down to the freight depot. Okay, so this one is empty. That's a lot of oil barrels. I would have dreamed that this would have been a box car load, not. Yeah. Not a, an open cordwood car. Maybe just a little bit more. Yeah, it'll go. Okay. I ain't scared. Wow, I was way off, wasn't I? Yeah. Yeah. And I was even closer the, close to it. The heck was I looking at? I'm gonna blame it on the roll. It rolled. <laughs> there you go. It loading yet? No, I'll tell you when as soon as I see one. Dirt, you got it. Okay. Yep, the magical oil burial barrel ferry is dropping the <laughs> oil down for us that looks a bit weird yeah because i swore last time it rolled down these ramps and onto the cars but we yeah, do I think it did, yeah. one barrel <laughs> Ooh. all right well let's map it down to the uh the parked place. oil train so you want the depot not the meat yeah okay yep you figured it out i, I added some depots in yeah ah you know what we should have done i never even thought about it What's that? Texas tea here is probably old. Yeah. 
Did we ever show him the other engine? Uh, well, I think we tried, but... Uh, it wouldn't climb the hill either. Well, that's right. right. It, it was a lot worse than the other one. Yeah. And this one's still got some pressure in it, so I might be able to get it backed up. different route correct we're going straight back to get loaded okay. these are all empty we emptied them yep and i redid well i redid the track the bridge up the hill and stuff too though Oh yeah, I was, I was screwing around with that. The horn don't sound as good because I don't really have very much pressure left. Yeah, I was putting the buildings kind of narrow or close together. I should have a little, little bit more room. Yeah, well. Maybe something makes to screw perfect, around right? with. Maybe we'll get a yeah. passenger train service going. Give it some one-star Google reviews because it has no air conditioning and it's set back in the you know the narrow gauge days. Right. <laughs> well, the temperature's coming up, so we should be starting to make some steam here in a minute. Well, that's good. I forgot these are kind of tight back here. Yeah, you want to load this uh, back one first? If I can get her stopped in time. All right, you on the brakes? Yep. <laughs> How close? Uh, it's getting close. I think you overshot it by a little bit, but. Well, it'd help if you give it, tell me. <laughs> Which way? Forward? Yeah, hold on. Let me get this out a little bit. Can we fill two of these at once or no? I yes, we remember. was doing two last time. Okay. Let me get these out and then... Okay, forward. How far? Uh, about two foot, three foot. Uh, whoa. You need me to come back and help you? Uh, well, shit. Maybe need to back up just a hair. I don't know how touchy this is going to be. Whoa. I'll come back. <laughs> oh, shoot. Okay. I guess I should have opened the lids up on my nice long run. Both of them filling. No. You want to open the valve down there? Can. Ready? Yep. Okay. Well, we got to open these valves too. Yeah. Okay, 
Okay, so that one's at one. This is at two. Yeah, so two. I think before we were standing down on the ground and shutting the one off down there. Yeah. So you want to tell me when it gets to eight? Yep. I'm at four. Five. Eighty-five. Twenty-four. Thirty-two. And eight. Shut it off. Ah, huh. it's still going. What? I don't see. Oh, didn't shut it off down here. Yeah. That's weird. That's dumb. Huh. Like it leaked through. Okay. Maybe we need to get some depends for it. I guess. <laughs> more work to do unfortunately all right i'm backing up okay need to have a redemption of this uh train trying to pull that hill yeah Keep coming. All right, start the break. All right about there. I'm coming back. Okay. I think first I'm going to open up the the lids on my way back. The ones I didn't get. Sure. Yeah, I see you got a bunch of them. So I don't know if you have to do that one down there or not. That's four. No, it's not coming, is it? Shoot. Maybe you have to, I guess. Yeah, before you always had to open both. Yeah. Five. Six. Well, this one up here is only at two. I know. Seven. Eight. Okay, so if I turn that to zero, hopefully it doesn't leak out. So. This one's up high. Six. Seven. 24. Eight. You shutting it off up there? Yeah. Okay. I'll let you just control them up there. I'll run back up here and get in the, the big engine. Hopefully everyone stayed warm during the week and all the beautiful, wonderful snow we had. Right. Well, I'm sure the kids love to be off if they had snow days. Yeah. I 
wish I could be off on snow days. Yeah. How was this time? It was kind of nice. <laughs> Not going to say I got anything done, but hey. <laughs> Start to slow down. About there. You control both of them. Oh. Shoot. Run five miles an hour. Ten miles an I hour just ran off the other end. <laughs> Yeah, I got this one. If you want to get that one. Yeah, I will. I'm just... Like watching paint dry. <laughs> Pretty much. At least on once we get them loaded or whatever. Shouldn't take us too much longer to get the rest of these. I just yeah, hope it pulls that hill since I redid it, but yeah, we well, all know how that's going to go. That's probably good there. You got all that hard concentration going. Right. Oh, I jumped. Freaking missed the platform again. I saw you. <laughs> Pretty funny watching you fly by and right down. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> the one time I get to be like Superman. <laughs> Yeah, the only thing bad I think about the buildings is they didn't put interiors in them. Oh, yeah. I hadn't checked them out yet. They've got several different variations of each one, so you can, you know, you can make it a, a town that's, you know, not identical. Right, which would be cool. We'll get some more people. That way they can hang out in town, but have 800 conductors running around. Right. That's good. Oh, my run's getting shorter. Yeah. Oh, you made it. <laughs> that time I did. <laughs>
Only a couple more, then we'll be heading up. Total. I see now. Got an oddball. Yeah, somehow. Next, we need to get a mod for a pipeline and just pipe the shit up there. Yeah, right. <laughs> jumped it. I missed it because I was busy looking to see if uh, uh whoa, 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 right there. Oh, I was seeing if I got enough room to back up. Making a wild and wonderful trip to the refinery. shut either. Failing at my job. Yeah, there's some law offices down here. I'm going to stop and make sure I can legally fire you. <laughs> Don't want any repercussions. All right. I'm not for sure if there's a Bureau of Workers Compensation down there, but <laughs> I'm sure OSHA would approve of you not wearing a hard hat and <laughs> jumping from mm -hmm. ground to yeah <laughs> and you probably don't have no fr clothing on either yeah probably not a whole list of osha violations here yeah and i'm pretty sure i'm not trained in running a steam boiler <laughs> or license <laughs> yeah that low <laughs> we're cranking her down 
This time we're getting a run. Watch, I'll get up here and the switches won't be lined up right. It should be though. I just don't know if I can take that one that fast. But we can still truck it right through here. So we're still with that big old black cloud flying behind her. Right. All that ozone pollution. Does look good though. But the town people know we're coming through. I think if you get it a little bit closer to the train track, that would look amazing. I think it looks pretty good close together like you have it. Yeah. I was just seeing how it would look and trying to get ideas on, you know, putting it in, but... That's probably not a final design, it's just being placed there for right now. Yeah. And if any developers watch this, I would love to have a Y switch without the third leg. Yeah, that would make it really nice. Making sure we don't derail here. I think we may have her. I would also like some uh, other color ballast. Maybe like a more of a gray. But because, I, I mean, to me, I would like to decipher, like, that town area. I could put ballast in between the buildings and make it look like more of a walkway versus the same color as the road bed, you know? No. I don't know. I mean, well, I hope when I redid this, I left the switch going the right way. Okay, we're picking up speed. It's actually working this time. We got her up to 26. Good. I must have been dropping her down too far last time. We got her down to 30%. We just hit 27 mile an hour. Cross your fingers, the switch is going the right way. Alright. I think it is. So this is the new bridge. Or the new ramp up, I should say. smoother but she don't sound like it come on girl come on baby come on. we made it yeah but we ain't got the train all the way up over it yet i know we're down to 12 i think we've yeah, got her we'll made though it. we'll make it we'll make it We've got it. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Yeah, that looks a lot better. Still bulked it way down, but... Yeah. It wasn't like 
I'm kind of wondering if we would have been at the regular 22 mile an hour if it would have made it. Because we was clear down to 12 mile an hour. Maybe getting all the way up to 27 helped. Yeah, maybe it did. Yeah, and I redid a lot of this and raised it up and made it flatter. That's good, right? And then I put a turn in so both the outside tracks both meet up. And it's not like climbing a giant hill with a fully loaded train either like it was before. Slow down a bunch. Okay. I think if you roll at that speed there, I think we're okay. Maybe. Looks like it. Yep. Yeah, maybe a little faster. Well, the problem is, is the turn here. I'm trying. Because then it's like you hit a point and it wants to take off. Right. Get some of that Colico oil here. can't even see what's going on. I'm just trying to keep her slow moving. Yep, you're doing fine right now. I'm getting it unloaded. Actually, that speed that you're going right now is pretty good. Yeah, one mile an hour. Yeah. I mean, if we went much faster, paint would dry quicker. Yeah. You could bump it up just a little bit faster, but not much. What do you want me to do? Drive it like American Truck Simulator? Well, I mean, we never get shit unloaded then. <laughs> There's no other trains to crash into at the moment. Well, that's a plus. I mean, where we got to go? Uh, three. Two. But having it circle around, is that a lot better? Well, the, the other way had to climb a hill to keep it from going in the ground. True. Putting this tight turn on it here kept it to where it's more level. It's not completely level, but it's a lot closer to being flat. Yeah. Which allows well, it to, you know, 
I'm not struggling trying to pull up the hill. Going one miles an hour? Yeah, that would suck. Well, you know, in a fully loaded or whatever. Yeah. You get it? Yeah, that's the last one unloading. Yep, we're good. All right. We're how many more barrels we're going to make here. I'll beat you. Oh, well, we got 46 barrels here now. Yeah. That's a whole car of load. Uh, how many's here? 45 in that one. more cars to fill up so that ain't terrible is it done making them yeah I think so it was down to no oil when man this the place last one's dropped place just sucks right through the oil doesn't it yeah it does so we can just fill up the last two cars and we'll be done right well, we're going to be one barrel shy, but it is what it is. Oh, we can't have that. Well. I'm going to take you down to the law office as I'm suing you. <laughs> Let's try to get both the uh, cars lined up. Okay. That way when the magic barrel ferry drops them out of the sky. Not too fast, not too slow. Could go a little bit faster here. <laughs> yeah, that's all right. Um, get ready to stop. Right about there, somewhere. That's gonna do both of them. Yeah, looks like it. From up here, it doesn't look like it's even close. Oh, well, maybe pull forward just a little bit more. I guess. Yeah. I'm That'll definitely work there. Yeah, I don't like the way you got to do these just right. Yeah, I know. Or they sit there and they'll flip and go back the other way. Yeah. Oh, magic barrel fairy. Let the oil barrel, money barrels drop out of the sky. There it goes. Still has not yet. Really? Still no? I don't see any yet. Here you go. You got it now. Okay. I'm going to go check some switches real quick. Okay. Since mine's low anyways and won't. Big money coming with this load. I guess I should have teleported farther up. Of course, it takes a couple minutes to load them anyway, so not a biggie. I just like to see the train with the oil barrels on it finally. Yeah. Well, it would have been a lot sooner if they wouldn't have had the other industries, but yeah, I'll take but, that because I mean, now, now it's time for dad some more. I don't know what, yeah. but maybe like textiles or something. Yeah, something. That'd be cool. And the barrels are still falling out of the sky. Yeah. Oop. Well, 
but it is a lot of oil barrels. They're only coming one at a time, too, whereas everything else was three. Yeah, I know. That's strange, isn't it? I, I didn't even realize that. You know, we still got some pipe and lumber going over here, so yeah. You done? Yep. All right, we got money rolls up here. If I could get in. Hello. There we go. Got in. <laughs> yep, finally. Okay. Gotta make sure the whistle works. Get up here on the oil would be nice. Come on. Ah, there we go. Okay. Oh no, it doesn't want me up here. Yeah, you're standing on my money. Get off. fall down through it. They should have the green barrels for money, not blue barrels. But. Yeah. Remind you of something else blue. So made this turn a lot more gradual too. I think it looks better than what it did. Yeah. Before it had so. all them waves and humps in it back there. Yeah. Yeah, no, I think it looks good. I think it did a good job. And like I said, you know, last time was trial by error. Just getting up there and seeing how it does and then make adjustments. Oh, we're at 34, 35, 36 mile an hour, 37. You're gonna hit 40? 40. 43. We're running at 42 right now. Holy moly. Not bad, but <laughs> it could be an issue. <laughs> Alright, I'm getting scared. I mean, we surely got here in a hurry. <laughs> That was like, almost like a speed trip or something. Right. Nope. Heck, we're cruising along at 39 right now. Not bad. Gonna overshoot the thing. Oh yeah, I better start breaking. <laughs> yeah, we're coming uh, down. I, I, we're coming down quick. Yeah, I, I fell off, but I gotta get up there and you might have to back up. I don't know. <laughs> That was definitely going fast. Yeah, running 42 almost the whole way. That's the fastest I think we've been in this. Yeah. Well, I'm, I think and, I did 50 at one time, but. And it held, too. I mean, it went around that pretty good. Hold up. Yeah, I know. I'm trying Are to get the whole the thing in there. You want me to start unloading or not yet? Yeah, go ahead. I don't care. I'm out. Out and about. I'm watching. Okay, there. Start to unload. I got that one. Okay. And then, of course, I hit it to stop it. Of course. Hmm. 
Mm, this one might not load too. So, yeah, cool. That's why I was trying all to get right. all the way up here to the very end. Yeah. And that all that money good. going away. Woo. Heck yeah. That's some good money there. Now we can buy a real engine shed. <laughs> yeah. Now they don't cost nothing, but. Oh, guys, there's the uh, the good old oil barrels getting to the freight depot. I wonder if we can get her to do 42 on the way back. I don't know. Well, at least take it up there and get her parked for the next load. Yep. And we're ready. All right, I'm running back up. I need some of that Garth Brooks song. When the money rolls. Right. <laughs> Does the lightning or thunder? Mm -hmm. And the thunder rolls. Yep. Some miles an hour. 24. No, not bad. section really help. Yeah, it did. I'd like to get 30 out of her before we hit the hill, but I don't think we're going to. Uh, 28's not bad, though. We've got 29 now. I dropped her on the... Let me see if this little extra bit I drop here helps. Yeah, I'm still just holding at 29. Not bad. No. I'm going to lose all that speed going up this hill. All right. And that hill don't even look that steep. No, it doesn't. Until you actually get going up it. But I don't think we'll lose a lot of it because we're not loaded, but... Now maybe we will lose quite a bit. Eh, 24, 23 mile an hour. That ain't bad. No. One of the quickest trips we've ever made. Of course, it did take forever to load it, but... Right. Not a biggie. Take the uh, crude oil train back and park it where it needs to go. Yeah. Well, guys, with a lot of hard work and moving a lot of freight back and forth, we've now hauled everything there is to haul. So, when we get more chances to live stream, we might be doing more of a, like American Truck Simulator type deal. 
until they come out with some more stuff for this or we set up something different. Well. Yeah, it don't matter. We're not loading nothing. No, I know. I was just getting that there close. You're right. taking this one back, you said, right? Yeah. I, that one switch is going to need switched. I can't think of which one it is, but. Um, where did I go? I fell through the floors. Not again. Now how'd the firebox only move 1% with a full shell load of coal? What? Hoopas didn't come apart. Not that one up there, I'm not worried about. It's the one that you'd make the turn to go towards the oil refinery. I still would like to try to do the bridges over top of the drop-off points at some of these just to see if you could, you know, run a real long train and just it fall down on it, but I'm not sure. I keep talking about it and I never do it. Of course, that would be a heck of a lot higher up in the air we'd have to get. Did you find that switch I was talking about? Nah, I'm not, yeah. it, it'd be the one. So if you were coming back up here, it would be the one after that Y. The Y I was talking about earlier. The next one after the Y heading south or whatever. Now we're gonna see what kind of speed record we can set with this thing. Train flying by you at 100 mile an hour. Well, yeah. At 39 mile an hour. What's up, Grizzly? Howdy. too far I hope not hey, get in the engine get in the engine if you're there yet yeah. Jeez. Okay. reverser go for it I'll let it go in reverse yeah I'll run it okay I'll stand back here and be a conductor for once you can be the big engineer. Bring her on back. 
Let's hear some whistle. All right, get off the uh, gas. Yeah, I got the regulator at zero. All right, we're coasting back. I was going to jump off and move something, but then I was like, eh, we ain't got enough time. Start riding the brake. And there we go, guys. That is the oil barrels of money down to the whatever you call that place. And the uh, I came came freight depot. Alrighty, guys. Thanks for watching. Until next time, which we may end up doing an American truck after this. I don't know. So, but if we do, you'll see us on. If not, we'll see you next time.